hey guys welcome back to my channel this video is going to be a quick little video uh, to show you guys my rouge coco flash my Chanel rouge coco flash uh, collection I kind of wanted to show you what uh, what colors I own and what they look like on so in case you were wondering this is what the packaging looks like just that typical uh, Chanel packaging this is what the bullet looks like they have a top where you can uh, see the color sort of through the top and then you have the product information on the bottom all right so let's get started the first color that I went ahead and will uh, try it on I'm gonna do lightest to darkest just because that's gonna be much simpler having to take off and put on um, lipstick this one the first one I'm gonna show you is number 208 Lumiere and this is a really pretty nude peach shade very creamy the formula on this is like a very pigmented balm it looks very nice on the lid it's very comfortable and this is one of my favorite shades in the collection the next shade I uh, wanted to talk about of course is like the most popular shade and that's gonna be boy now this is a color that was when it was reformulated everybody said it changed a little bit and I own the original one uh, obviously I've used it already but I kind of can't tell the difference when I put it on it's very very slight uh, it can in some lightings look a bit cooler than the other one but honestly it, just, it looked the same to me so each one of these uh, lipsticks retail for $38 and then the next color I want to show you this is from the original line and it's the only one that I currently own from the original line and this is number um, 93 in time if you guys watched my LaBeige's video that I just uploaded you guys would know that I referenced this color because I bought I recently got uh, number 116 easy and it really reminded me of in time and this is a really pretty like purpley lavender nude I love colors like this so I am gonna really quick before I move on to easy I'm gonna swatch it on the back of my hands just to see how similar they really are okay so definitely this is in time over here and this is easy easy is much more pink and in time still has more of that lavender look so I guess it kind of reminded me of it, but they're not as similar as I thought it would be. So the next color um, you're gonna see now is Easy. This is number 116. I did uh, purchase this. This is one of the brand new colors that just came out. And um, Chanel, I got it off of the Chanel.com website, so that color keeps coming in and out of stock. So just keep your eye out, uh, don't lose hope if you see that it's sold out all right the next color is gonna be number 53 in chicness and this is a very basic brown nude it's absolutely gorgeous this is one of my favorite shades in the entire collection I think they need to expand their like nude brown range I think that this is such a nice color and the next color I'm going to show you is number 91 Boheme and this is totally out of my comfort zone this is like a candy apple color 
it definitely has like that fuchsia, fuchsia sort of tone. Perfect for the summer. So cute. And then the last and final color is actually considered a topper. Um, this was explained to me by one of the associates at uh, Bloomingdale. This is Bloomingdale's. This is number 204 Deepness. So this shade, you can wear it alone, but really it was designed as a topper to wear over like uh, any lipstick to make it darker. You can make any shade deeper with this. So if you have like a liquid lipstick or a matte lipstick um, or even an, uh, a lip liner. So what I use this for is I'll put on like a lip liner and I'll use that all over my lips and then I'll put a coat of this on top and it kind of just gives it that really pretty like deepened look but it's like moisturizing it's great i really love this top coat they have a uh, like one more i think or two correct me if i'm wrong in the comments below but this was the only one that i really really liked i love anything that's gonna change whatever color i have to something a bit deeper i don't know why but i do it's something it, I, I can't explain it every time I see black lip gloss it just it excites me uh, for some odd strange reason but anyways that is my complete collection of the Chanel Coco shine uh, lipsticks that I own I uh, wanted to do this video just because I have so many of these and I use them on and off I kind of alternate them sometimes depending on what i'm wearing and i said you know what this will be like a good video for everybody to see like nice uh swatches on lips of what these colors actually look like on in case you guys were thinking of purchasing any because i feel like a lot of the times when you go on the chanel website or any website not just the chanel website the pictures that they put of the models wearing the lipstick is never what you get when you receive the lipsticks in the mail like I don't know why but um, I wanted to film it in natural light because I wanted you guys to see uh, the colors and how they look like on on uh, if you guys are wondering what I'm wearing on my lips now this is not I'm not wearing any of these right now I'll leave everything my whole makeup look I'll go ahead and leave that in the description down below so that you guys um, can know exactly what I'm wearing down to my nail polish in case you guys are wondering anyways guys that completes this video thank you so much for watching and see you next time bye